What is happening, y'all? Cowboy here, and I think I fucked up. So, uh, I'm on the boat, but as you can see, the water's moving, but our perspective to the horizon is not changing. The boat's not actually moving at all. Um, that's not all. The other problem is my health is slowly going down because of heat exhaustion. I am not wearing a summer outfit, and it is hot as balls, because the boat ended up sailing all the way down to here, and I'm pretty sure that you can't actually go here. I think there's an invisible wall. So, uh, my best bet is going to be to get over towards Wraith Waste Manor, um, but as we've seen a number of times, while Arthur can swim, there is a very, very high chance that I will probably die trying to swim, uh, just due to sheer exhaustion. So, I'm going to do uh, our best bet here. Well, I do want to see if I can go further or if there's an invisible wall. And so, here's what we're going to do. I am going to fortify my health. I'm going to fortify stamina. And then I'm just going to try and swim for it because I can't do anything else. So, health cure. Go, and stamina cure. And let's, uh, there we go, cowboy. Uh, I need you to, right. Oh, now the boat has no problem continuing on. And I see the fortification did absolutely nothing there. I don't think, yeah, I'm pretty sure there's just an invisible wall here and I can't proceed. So, our best bet, well, closest spot to land is probably going to be right there. I think I'm going to die. The stamina fortification didn't do dick. I don't think I can actually swim that way. What is going on? I can't swim at all. Arthur, why can you not swim? Is this is this my fate? I'm just stuck to drown out here. As soon as I, so the boats are apparently Oh man, this is bad, y'all. This is really bad. Uh, am I swimming? Is this swimming? I don't feel like I'm actually going anywhere. Let me try going north. See if it feels like I'm going anywhere. I think I might actually just have to fucking die. That's it. That's all I can do. It's just die. I mean, eventually I'm going to run out of stamina. And it looks like fortifying health doesn't do anything when you're uh, dying to heat exhaustion. And the lack of stamina means that I'm, I'm basically forced to drown out here. So, you know what? You, you live and you learn. Well, in this case, you die. Um... But note to self, never get out of your goddamn canoe and try and hop on a different boat because it's going to end very poorly for you. Stamina will regenerate slower, sleep or eat food. Okay, so now I have no stamina core. I'm slowly... I feel like I'm slowly going underwater. Deeper and deeper. Oh, oh here we go. Now we're drowning. Just let it just... just sleep now, Arthur. And that's how the game ended. I mean, this is probably my most disappointing death in a video game, I think, ever. I tried to explore the world, and I got jebated, and was forced to either choose from heat exhaustion or drowning. Where the hell are we now? You can rest by holding. Sit here and rest? No. I mean, how we get our cores full. Alright, well, the first thing I gotta do is get rid of this outfit. Arthur is. 
dying of heat. That's my game blend outfit. I don't want to wear it. There we go. All right, next is to get some cores back. My only other oregano prime beef. Or to save that. Let's go through all the big beans we got. Damn, Arthur, just throwing that shit on the ground, are we? Okay. Oh, is that the only baked beans I had? Shit. Some more biscuits. Anything that's real good? Oh, yeah, the apple actually does a fair amount of stamina. One more, I can probably top things off. Alright. So, looking at the map, where the hell are we? We are right on the edge. So, let's uh, make our way to the road and see what's down here. We've come about as far south as we can. Oh, there's a boat right there. A boat that I could probably control. And part of me is tempted. See if I can actually cross. I want to see what happens here. Because there's a whole land over there. I'm in the outfit now. I'm in my summer outfit. And I actually control where this boat goes. So let's see. Will I hit that same invisible wall? Will I just stop moving? Oh, it looks like I'm moving. Oh, maybe... Oh, I don't know. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh, God, no. No, no, no. The boat just force sinks? Oh, Jesus Christ. Wow. This is not my fucking day. <laughs> well, I guess we know what happens if you take a canoe out here now, too. Just... Oof. Indeed. Um, how's it feel having drowned alive twice, Arthur? Fuck it, I ain't going through everything. I'll just eat, eat the prime beef, get my shit up. Let's do a little, uh, buddy home. Shotgun and a repeat. Aged pirate rum. Can't go wrong with that. Stuff is a uh, permanent increase to your stamina. Stamina is at max level. Well, shitty titties. I guess all that swimming and drowning was worth something. Drunk. What the fuck is going on here?
found a crazy young woman, real strange looking, locked in a kind of outhouse, hidden on Braith Race Mansion land, in a kind piece for folk like her. Of course, this is the shit I gotta stumble on when I've been drinking. Come on, horse. Let's let's get out of here. What? You know what? Hang on a second. I'm, I'm right on Braithwraith's property. Oh, man. That's a big-ass spooky thing on the map. Braithwraith. I wonder if I can go find the uh, proprietor of the land. Basically call out and be like, hey, uh, found something of yours. Little encampment here. How are you, ma'am? Hello, sir. We ain't, ain't fucking anything out here. Ladies, 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 doggy. Yeah, doggy. Yes, I pet the doggy. Hello, boy. Ma'am? Hello. Hey, ma'am. Hi there. Out of fine posterior you have there. How's it going with you? Oh, I've been better. Sorry to hear that. All the best. Farewell. Go on up to this manor, see if we can't have a chat about the crazy outhouse girl that we just found. Hey there, mister. Damn, wish I could trade my shit stain mare in for yours. Excuse me, partner. Hey there. I walk on up real fancy like. Hey, mister. Sir. Looking for the proprietor. Calm down. Uh huh. Okay, you... okay. I'm done now. I swear. <laughs> Shit, what the hell are you doing? You can't be here. All right, simmer down. Yeah, keep on moving. Keep on. Hey, why are these guys such dicks? Hey there, partner. Hell, you ain't supposed to be here. Oh, this does give me an idea. Oh, fucking assholes, man. It's weird, it's coming in from the back. Nobody noticed a thing. Damn. Where does their land stop? Jesus Christ. Ain't this the main road? I remember how to wait. How do I wait? I got good boy points for leaving that area.
Fuck you guys. As long as they don't see me, they don't know any better. I'm gonna rob the shit out of this mansion. I remember how to wait. Is it this? That's task. I guess we're dusk right now. Dead man shouldn't talk. Little bit of that. All I wanted to do was go in the old sneaky way, but everybody else had to turn this into a thing. The hell does this house have so many fucking windows? Let me in. There's clearly people inside. How do I get inside? might get this open. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I came all the way over here, shot down about two dozen men, threw dynamite, and I still can't get in this fucking house. You know what? Let's get the hell out of here, Stella. There's ain't nothing here for us except a bunch of assholes. Assholes and drowning, that's all that we've had happen to us. Fortunately, they're so private about their affairs over here, I'm pretty sure that we don't even have a bounty for all that. Check the map, I'm pretty sure it just counts as a... Uh, Yep, just counts as a private altercation between myself and the folks of Braithwraith. Hopefully I get to come and explore this place a little bit later through a mission. Go ahead and take that off.
Hoping I'd find something. Something hidden. Oh, Christ. Well. Hotel. There. There's the hotel. Photo studio. Barber. Got saloons here. Lots of shows. Clothing place. Rapper and a fence. General store. Butcher. Gunsmith, the post office, the stagecoach. Got everything you could want in the town, except there ain't a single goddamn inn. Let's head on over there. That looks like a nice little spot. Or Rhodes. Rhodes is a mining town, though. Ain't much there either. Yep. Him all the way out of here. All I want to do is get a bath, nice wash, clean myself up a bit before heading back to camp and meeting up with Dutch. Tell nature hasn't been too kind to me lately. Down the good hall. See if this is a little town like Strawberry. Maybe I can. Uh, check it out hopefully oh actually you know what this is probably another rich folks place and they're gonna shoot at me any second I'd bet hey, what are you doing there? yep hey mister this is your final warning excuse fucking me I didn't know y'all own the whole goddamn yeah. town Out of my way, dickhead. Christ, I cannot win, man. What is up with the south... The south half of the map in this game is just filled with shit. Banners that you just approach, and, and everybody is fucking pissy with you. Doctor is usually by the end. Let's go talk to the doc. I gotta stay on the trail around here, otherwise it's one false step and I'm gonna end up being a fucking lunchable for an alligator. I mean, I can sprint past this shit though. The hell is this? Looks like a hideout if I've ever seen one. Abandoned station, I guess. Saint Denise. Down in the bayou. Excuse me, old man. You looking for friends in this town? Cause you ain't gonna find none. You the local hard man, huh? I killed a lot of folk to keep this town free. Happy to add you to the list. That's right. We don't answer to no one. I remember how I do my That's it. <laughs> Crime reported. It was a crime. Come on now. They don't know who did it though. Face masks should work. Oop. I don't know if those guys see me, it won't. The 
Just a fancy man riding on into town. I ain't never seen nor killed that man. What a pity. How did I... So it's not R2. I was trying to do the horse things. I know there's like shit you can do with the horse. I thought it was like you hold something and you... It's R1. You're supposed to use R1. Well, now we know. I look pretty fucking dapper riding around town on a white horse. His outfit in the cap. Looking pretty good. I had about enough of that bomb in front of his mouth. Just in case shit goes south, kind of man that likes to have some things with him. Really wish it would save my like my two uh, guns as like favorites, you know. Got down here. See if we can't discover a little side business here with Mr. Medicine Man. I really wish you could, you know, like, shoot the lock off or force it and, like, break in. Like, you know, as much as this game touts realism and freedom, there's a surprising amount of shit that you can't do that you'd think you'd be able to. You can rob people and hold them up at gunpoint, but there's hundreds of buildings that are just fucking shells. How's everything? I'm feeling fine. Which is irritating. Howdy. Well, anyway, um, I'm going to wrap this one up here, but I think this next episode, since we have finally made our way down to the south of Chapter 3, I'm going to spend some time actually uh, digging deep into this city and exploring it. I've come here a couple times, but... You know, came here once to play poker uh, on stream, and then once to check out the gunsmith, and then I robbed, and you know, I haven't really, like, explored around this city and seen what it has to offer. So make sure to stay tuned. Catch y'all next time as we do a little deep dive.